Happy Thanksgiving, Salem. I'm Todd. I'm part of our Salem stewardship team, and I'm here to talk about our 50-50 giving initiative this year. One of our ministry partners this year is Covenant World Relief and Development. CWRD works to reduce human suffering for the world's most vulnerable people. This year, our hearts have been broken over the suffering amidst conflicts in Ukraine, Israel, and Palestine, and elsewhere. Natural disasters and injustices like human trafficking especially affecting our most vulnerable neighbors around the world. Through it all, CWRD is there. Here's some more about their work. Covenant World Relief and Development has been the humanitarian arm of the Evangelical Covenant Church since the days of the devastation of World War II. In response to the war, Covenanters took up a collection to give to an organization called World Relief, and that's where our original name, Covenant World Relief, came from. We participate in God's transforming mission in the world through disaster relief, and then over time, we have recognized that long-term transformation happens through community development. We know that disaster relief saves lives. Community development work transforms lives and it prevents continued suffering. That's why in the year 2020, we added the word development to our name. Today, we are Covenant World Relief and Development. We continue to engage in disaster relief and community development, primarily with local indigenous partners around the globe. This is part of the strategy and philosophy of Covenant World Relief and Development to work with local leaders. I'll tell you about a few of our partners. We actually have over 30 organizations that we partner with in more than 20 countries. In Europe, we are once again responding to war. The war in Ukraine has caused refugees to flood into many countries in Eastern Europe and now into Western Europe. The kind of support that we're providing for refugees includes hygiene kits, food supplies, housing, job placement, trauma counseling, and even recreational camps for refugee children. In Southeast Asia, a great example of the kind of work that we do is an organization called the Mulberries Project in Laos. Today, the Mulberries Project works with hundreds of villages in five provinces. The villagers raise mulberry trees, feed the leaves to the silkworms, harvest the silk and dye it, weave it into cloth, and make beautiful dresses and other finished textiles. This project provides the villagers with training, tools, and access to markets for a sustainable financial future. In Latin America, one of our partners is Cose Perdil of Honduras. They work to creatively address the water needs of their community. The genius of Cose Perdil is that the labor for installation and maintenance of their water systems rests entirely with the local community. This ensures lasting success. One of our partners in Africa, the Evangelical Covenant Church of South Sudan and Ethiopia provides livestock and training for refugees. They support widows who are forming community gardens, even in refugee camps. They care for orphans and they facilitate reconciliation work jobs to foster long-term sustainable peace among people in South Sudan and Ethiopia. Covenant World Relief and Development has a mission to work with God and our global ministry partners to reduce human suffering and increase human flourishing in the name of Jesus. And we are blessed to be able to work with local grassroots organizations who know their communities incredibly well. They have great expertise, and because of their local community networks, they're so much more effective. That means that your donations have a greater impact. In fact, when you give to Covenant World Relief and Development, you can be assured that at least 90% of your donation goes directly to work on the ground with local ministry partners around the world. Through CWRD, we get to see people transformed and to be transformed ourselves in the process. We are Covenant World Relief and Development. Will you join us in this process of transformation? This Thanksgiving, as we celebrate all that we have to be grateful for, we invite you to support the 50-50 Giving Initiative with gratitude and generosity. 
Through this offering, we both give thanks and praise to God and will make an incredible life-saving difference in the lives of people around the world. Here's how you can give. You can open the camera on your phone and hold it up to the QR code. It'll take you right to the 5050 Giving Initiative donate page. Other options are, you can mail a check to Salem marked for the 5050 Giving Initiative. You can give an offering during this service or the Christmas Eve service. You can give online via Salem's website or app. Select the fund 5050 Giving Initiative. Any questions, call the church and ask for Marcy. However you choose to give, we are so grateful you're here with us. Thank you.